there were quite a few things about I'm Not Ready for Christmas that I really liked. Certain things I like to see in a film, especially around Christmas time or with a Christmas film. But I do have a problem with the protagonist. I'm Not Ready for Christmas was released in 2015, directed by Sam Irvin and written by Hans Wassenberger. And this is, of course, a Hallmark Christmas film. Very big Hallmark Christmas film fan here. Absolutely love them. And I really like Alicia Witt as one of our protagonists. I've seen her in maybe three or four other Hallmark Christmas films. And with regards to her character here, Holly Nolan, I I didn't really like her. And on the one hand, that's kind of the point. But at the same time, I didn't really care about her. So Holly is very much married to her work. And at the beginning of the film, she tells a lie to try and get ahead and to get um, a particular job that she's looking for. But then, when she doesn't turn up to her niece's Christmas show after she promised she would... Her niece asks Santa Claus, long story, you'll see how he fits into it, to make that her aunt can never tell a lie. And that's what the majority of the film is about. Holly can tell only the truth. And not only can she just tell the truth, but she will spill a lot. She cannot stop saying truths. And obviously it gets her, gets her into some sticky situations. But we also have, it's a Hallmark film, we have a romantic love interest. Of course we do. But of course, with Drew, um, played by George Stoltz, we don't necessarily know which direction this is going to take. But I think he has a really lovely attitude towards Holly's apparent openness and honesty. I, I can't pinpoint, you know, I like the narrative. I really like the narrative. And that whole not being able to tell a lie. I love that trope. Not the first film to do it. But I I think when it's done well like it is here, it's really enjoyable. And, you know, it's fun to see what kind of situations you're going to get into. But the character, there's just something about Holly that I didn't like. And I know she's meant to be kind of unlikable and standoffish until she goes through this character development. But even as she realises the importance of telling the truth and what she should really be focusing on in life. I just, I never took to her. I never warmed to her. Obviously nothing to do with the acting. As I said, Alicia Witt is somebody I really enjoy in a Hallmark film. On that note, I have to say Mia Bagley, who plays Anna, her young niece, absolutely loved her. Uh, Brilliant performance. Great on-screen chemistry between them as well. So really, I can't fault the film. There's nothing specific about it that I didn't like, apart from her protagonist. But that wasn't to such an extent that I kind of just didn't enjoy the film because I really did. But if you're looking for a film where there's a really likable protagonist and you want to go on the journey with them, this is not the one. But if you're looking for a really nice Hallmark Christmas film, I'm very happy to recommend I'm Not Ready for Christmas.